Welcome to the University of Malta, an institution rich in history and knowledge. Today, we will take you on a journey through one of its most valuable treasures, the Archives and Rare Books Department. The Archives Department at the University of Malta Library serves as the guardian of a vast collection of manuscripts, rare books, personal papers, and university records that date back centuries. The department is dedicated to preserving the rich history of our university and the border Maltese heritage. Our archives are based on three pillars, manuscripts, rare books, and special collections that offer a unique glimpse into the past. While visiting the archives, one can find more than 500 items of manuscripts that range from the 10th century up to the 20th century that focus on different aspects of our island's identity, such as language, religion and music. Among the treasures is a fragment written in Greek of a lectionary dating back to the medieval times. This manuscript was discovered by Monsignor Pietro Paul Saidon in a book which was sent for a binding. In August 1956, an interesting discovery was made when old playing cards were recovered from wall cavities in the theology room at the old university campus in Valletta. These cards originally formed part of a deck of cards which depict figures of knaves and kings. The figures are robed in the military attire of the Order of St. John of Jerusalem, adorned with the eight-pointed cross of the Order. Other manuscripts housed in the cabinets include 18th and 19th century sermons written in Old Maltese, poems by Don Carmsail and Rizabriffa, and Paolo Policino diaries, among others. Within the archives, one can also find a small and rich collection of rare books. These books range from literature to cuisine and religious items, all of which are valuable in their own right. One of the oldest books housed in our collection is a Bible written in Latin, which dates back to 1552. Malta Lustrata by Gianfrancesco Bella and Giovanni Antonio Chantar is another rare book which gives a detailed account of the Maltese islands during the 18th century. This book is one of great interest among patrons and researchers visiting the archives. Other treasured monographs include both Michel Anton Vassalli's Lexicon, published in 1796, and a book illustrating the Maltese Revolution against the French dating to 1799. Several donors have entrusted the department with their own valuable works and collections. These collections range from different fields of research, political and family history, literature, Maltese folklore, botany and archaeology. The Bonavita family donated their family history collection, which dates back to the 1500s. This collection includes beautifully illustrated family trees, coats of arms, and detailed petitions and contracts. The watercolor botanical drawings by Guido Lanfranco are also one of our most treasured possessions. These colorful and detailed drawings feature indigenous and endemic flora of the Maltese islands, such as with nettle bahar, devotiles, and poppy flowers. The special collections also contains a significant amount of literature written by Maltese authors. These include Italian poems by Giovanni Curmi and Albert M. Castola, and the esteemed works of Oliver Frigieri and Giuseppe Catcuti. Other notable donors include Henry Frendo, Gottfried Wettinger, and Joseph Muscat, who contributed immensely towards research in history and Maltese culture. Preserving these valuable materials is no small task. 
The Archives Department employs preventative conservation techniques in various ways. These include housing the material in a climate-controlled environment and using asset-free archival paper to ensure that these items endure for future generations. Books that show signs of insect infestations are sent for anoxic treatment to prevent further damage. As we look to the future, the Archives Department continues to innovate. With ongoing digitization projects and new initiatives, the Department is expanding its reach and enhancing its services. Together with the Digitization Department, the team works meticulously to preserve and digitize documents. It also employs the use of OCR technologies and an AI-powered transcription platform, Transcribus, to make this archival material more accessible while preserving the original documents. Digitized archival material is available online through the University of Malta Library Repository or at UM. The Archives and Your Books Department is committed to making its collections accessible. Researchers and students can explore these materials in our reading rooms with the assistance of our knowledgeable staff. Beyond research, the Archives Department also engages the public through exhibitions, bringing history to life for the broader community. The Archives Department at the University of Malta Library is more than a repository of old documents. It is a living part of our academic community, preserving our past and informing our future. Thank you for joining us on this journey. For more information or to explore the archives yourself, visit our website or contact the Archives Department at the University of Malta.